Everybody has their doubts, but you can't stop now. You just, you just gotta. It's Stephanie and welcome back to my channel. Today I am bringing you guys, as you can see from the title of this video, a collective haul video. It has been quite a while since I've done like a collective haul video. I just kind of do specifically one brand usually. But I went ahead and went to the mall today and I decided to do a little bit of shopping, get some things here and there for some upcoming trips. If you guys don't already know, I'm going to Disney World in two weeks exactly and then I'm going to Miami in the end of May for Memorial Day weekend. So. I've been trying to pick up things here and there for my vacations and just kind of trying to see what the new trends are and see what all the good sales that are going on right now. So I went ahead and went to the mall and picked up a few things. This is from mostly Forever 21, Michael Kors, Nike, uh, TJ Maxx, and I think that's it. I think that's everything. Um, majority of the items are coming from Forever 21, so we'll save Forever 21 stuff for the last, so we'll just do the little things first. So like always with all of my hauls, if I can find any of these items online, I will have them linked down below for you guys and easy access to shop in case you guys want to get anything, as well as all of my sizing and stats will be listed down below, and as well as my outfit details that I am wearing today, because I know I'm going to get questions. My crop top is from Fashion Nova Curve. My jean jacket is from Target Wild Fable. It's actually a cropped denim jacket. It. and my necklaces are from this kind of wrap um, necklace like this is from forever 21 and then this is actually a gold like pendant necklace that I got from my baptism when I was a baby so um, yeah that is what I'm wearing I'm loving all these like coins and like gold jewelry I love it and I'm wearing uh, forever 21 hoops so without further ado let's go ahead and get into this haul Okay, so the first item that I have to share with you guys from TJ Maxx is these really gorgeous thank you cards they're floral and they just say thank you on them they're like $3.99 um, if you guys don't know, I do have a Poshmark and I sell my clothes on there and things that I've either shown in videos that I'm just never going to wear or stuff that is new with tags. Um, majority of my items are either brand new with tags, never worn, or I have things that have been worn maybe once. Um, so all of my stuff is basically brand new on my Poshmark and I update that very frequently. So if you ever want to shop my closet, the link to my closet is down below as well. So these are just the thank you cards. I use these for when I mail out my Poshmark stuff and I just needed to stop up on some more so I got these um, I love all the thank you cards at TG Maxx they're gorgeous so the next thing I got which my mom actually spotted so shout out to you mom because I wouldn't have seen it this is the Becca in Jaclyn Hill shimmering skin perfecting um, highlight in champagne pop and it's more of the cream product so it is the Jaclyn Hill collaboration which I do believe is like discontinued I think they still sell champagne pop but it's not Jaclyn Hill anymore like they bought Jaclyn Hill out, so it's just Becca now. Um, but this has the original Jaclyn Hill packaging on it. And it is just your basic like champagne pop highlight. Um, it's just in like a cream form. It's going to be a really great product in the summertime, especially if you are more someone that likes to use cream products in the summer. I know I personally don't like to wear a ton of powder on my skin, so if I can get away with something as a cream product, like a cream blush, a cream contour, a cream highlight, that would be something that would be easier for me, especially if you're going out to the pool or something like that and you just kind of want to give yourself a natural glow, um, something like this would be great. And I picked this up at TJ Maxx and it was only $5.99 so it's such a steal and I am excited to use this in the summertime. Let's move on to Michael Kors which I only got one item from Michael Kors. They were having a pretty decent sale. This was the Michael Kors outlet so um, I usually go to the Michael Kors outlet unless there is some specific bag that I see online at like Macy's or the actual Michael Kors website that I buy but I do like going to the outlet because I feel like they have such cute stuff and it's like literally prices that you cannot beat. So their clearance I believe was like 70% off and then it was like an additional 20 so amazing amazing. And then I think the normal store was just 60% off with additional 20 which still isn't bad. So we're going to unwrap this and I got this for such a steal you guys, such a steal. This is the little wallet that I got from Michael Kors. It is just like one of those keychain wallets. I like to carry these types of wallets like this specifically when I go to Disney World because my backpack is already so heavy filled with hand sanitizer, Lysol spray, my little brush, my camera equipment, my cell phone, water, like there's just so much stuff that I carry in my Disney bag and I'm going to be doing a what's in my Disney bag before I leave for my trip. Um, so definitely stay tuned for that because it will be coming soon because I leave 
leave in two weeks. But I wanted to get a new wallet, so I went ahead and went over to Michael Kors. I got this really gorgeous black Michael Kors with silver hardware. It does have a zip little closure, so if you want to keep your cards in here and your change and stuff like that and your money, it could go in the zip pocket so you don't lose anything. And then the back also has where you can hold your ID and then again, a few cards. Um, I probably wouldn't hold anything here just because I want my stuff to be secure. But um, if you have like your Disney Pass or anything like that, gift cards, you can always put them in here as well too. And then there's that extra space. So this usually retails for $98. It was on clearance for $89 and then it was 70% off that and then another 20%. So my total, I believe, came to... My total was, uh, with tax, $23.82. So this wallet was a $100 wallet that I got for $23, which is amazing. So I love this, super cute and perfect to throw in like my little bags and stuff. So I've definitely been needing one of these and I love it. It's super, super cute. Love. Moving on, we have some stuff from Nike. So I have been recently, if you guys follow me on Instagram, if you don't already, it's just Stephanie Kroll on Instagram, go follow me there. But I have been working out religiously now for the past month and the Nikes that I have that I use and wear every day now are really starting to hurt my feet and they're old. They're from like 2016. I bought them the last time I went to Disney with my friend. I went into the Nike factory outlet at the outlet mall that I went to and these are the Nikes that I got. They are just um, Nike running shoes. Um, these are, I want to see if what the name is exactly of these. These Nikes are called the Women's Nike Free Run 2017. They are running shoes because I like lightweight shoes when I go to the gym. I do run on the treadmill, so I wanted to kind of get something that was comfortable and very lightweight, especially because I'm going to also be bringing these to Disney World most likely because I needed new gym shoes. So I'm going to be bringing these there. And these were only $39, and then with tax it came like $44, which is not bad at all. Um, they're really cute. They're just black, white, and gray. Super lightweight. They're very, very comfortable. So I'm excited to start breaking these in at the gym the next few days because I need to break them in before I go to Disney World. So I love those shoes. They're super cute. I love Nike gym shoes. They're probably my favorites. Um, and I always go to the Nike factory outlet because it's just, it's so much cheaper than spending splurging money on Nikes. I'm not a type of person to splurge on shoes. Like, I'm just not. So. I'm like, if I can get it at the outlet, I'm going to get it at the outlet. So that's what I did and got those. If I can find them online, I will try to link them for you guys. So moving on to the mother load that is Forever 21. We have a few things. It's not that much. A lot of it was clearance purchases. And um, I've been shopping the sale stuff lately so much because their sales have been great. So when I got some of these things from Forever 21, they were on the clearance and sale section. And all the clearance was, I think, an additional like percentage off. I can't remember what it was, additional 50% off or something like that or it was buy one get 150 or something I don't know remember what the promotion was I just kind of go on there from time to time and I saw some things that I wanted to get so we are going to start with that so the first thing that I got was this really cute little backpack and what it is is kind of like those little satchel backpacks that you can kind of carry like the Louis Vuitton Palm Springs bag how you can kind of wear it as just a purse and a crossbody and it just fits in the front perfectly stuff like this is really good for festival season like right now Coachella is going on this weekend and just like if you're gonna go to Lollapalooza or Spring Awakening any of like those festivals that are going around like Bonnaroo all that stuff something like this is really great because it's a backpack because you can carry it in the front of you if you don't Want to use a backpack but still want that backpack look you can just carry this and it's just like a little crossbody I think it is super cute and it's just black with gold hardware you can adjust the strap to make it longer or shorter just depending on how you want to wear it and I love it it's super super cute let me pull up my actual invoice of the clearance stuff because this was one when I bought stuff for clearance. Well, this bag was originally $19.90, only $20. And with the clearance that I had, it was $13.93. So not bad for a little bag. These are the... Where is the tag? Okay, so this item is just these uh, red polka dots shorts in a size 2x there is absolutely no stretch in these they have like the little ruffle detail here 
They're really cute. I love this. I bought this again because you guys know I'm going to Disney World. I bought this for one of my outfits for the day because we're going to be meeting Mickey and Minnie in their birthday attire because it's their 90th birthday celebration. And not only that, we're going to be celebrating my 25th birthday as well. So it's super awesome and we're going to get a picture with birthday Mickey and Minnie. And this is going to be three birthday buddies all together. So I wanted to have a cute kind of like... Disney bounding moment and dressing like Minnie and Mickey. So I got these red ones. They're really cute in a size 2X. They were normally $15.90 and I got them for $7.95. Again, no stretch in these at all. So if you do get these, make sure you size up or even up two sizes because they run pretty small. So just keep that in mind if you guys like those. The last pair, which is kind of similar because I didn't really know which one I was going to like better, um, is a pair of black polka dot shorts and these are just black and white the the bottom of them kind of flow a little bit better than the red ones they're a little bit more flowy but these are also pretty sheer um, and then these have the little tie in the front that you can tie it into like a little bow these were again normally $15.90 in a size 2x similar as to the red ones no stretch in them at all and these ones are you guys ready for how much I paid for these are you ready drum roll please 13 cents, 0 0.13, 13 cents. No joke, you guys, because it was such a great clearance at the time that I looked, so I can't really complain how these are fitting because I literally paid almost close to nothing for these shorts. So, really cute, love both of them. Haven't decided what I'm gonna wear yet exactly at Disney World on my birthday, but stay updated on my Instagram and you guys will see it in a couple weeks of what I decide to wear, so. That is that. So this next item is a swimsuit and I cannot find this online anywhere. I have looked high and dry for it. I th I'm starting to think that it's an in-store exclusive only so maybe hop over to your nearest Forever 21 that has a plus size section. This is a swimsuit. It's um, a one piece. It's a neon pink swimsuit. Look at it. It's like Barbie neon pink. Love it. The interior is like neon orange. You get the straps with it because it does um, have detachable straps. There is some padding inside here as well. And then the back has this really cute detail where it kind of has the two um, straps in the back to hold you in. And then it's just a little bit lower. Fully covered bottom. I love this so much. It is definitely going to be the swimsuit that I'm taking with me to Miami. I saw it and when I got it there was only a 2 X and a 3x left so I grabbed the 2x and it fits perfect and amazing and I love it and you guys will be seeing it all over my Instagram when I go to Miami like I said I couldn't find it online I will do my best if it's linked down below um, I will try to link something at least similar on Forever 21 from them. It's neon pink. I love it. I'm obsessed. Definitely get to your nearest Forever 21. I just bought this last weekend, so I don't know if that's going to help you guys at all. Um, but yeah, it's really cute and it's really comfortable and it fits perfect. Now we just have a few accessories from Forever 21. Um, I love their accessory section. It's just so cute. So the first thing that I got is this really cute headband. It is cheetah print headband. This was only $4.90. These headbands like this are super cute to like throw on when your hair is back. I think this is just something really easy to bring, especially in the summertime. And I, I would even wear it like this. Like I would literally wear my hair up in this little bun, throw on a little headband. Minus the tag and you're good to go. It's a really, really cute headband. I love these and they had all kinds of styles like floral prints and stuff like that. So love that. And then I got this really cute trendy like hair scrunchie but it has a little scarf detail. I think this is super cute. Again, I could throw it over my bun right now and then these two would just kind of hang in the back. Super, super cute. Just such like a cute little whimsical little feel. I feel like Wendy from Peter Pan with this. It's just really, really something different and I like it because the colors are just getting me ready for the summer and spring vibes. It is so nice today. It was like 70 degrees on Monday and then I'm not kidding you guys, Chicago is getting snow tomorrow. Like it's supposed to be 38 degrees in snow and then like 70 on Tuesday. Yeah, we're gonna, we're not gonna say the S word. S word meaning snow anymore because I've had enough. I've had enough, Mother Nature, I have. 
The last thing I got are these really cute earrings. They look like this. They're just hoops. And I like them because they remind me of these earrings from Kristen Cavalieri's Uncommon James line. And the ones from Kristen Cavalieri are like $74. Like they're kind of similar to this. Um, they're a little bit different. It's kind of like actually reversed where they have the hoop up and then the little pieces are dangling down. But it doesn't matter. It's still giving me the, the same effect that I wanted. I just can't justify spending $74 on jewelry so especially if it's not like real I don't even know if it's real gold I honestly don't know but I watch her show Uncommon James and she wears really cute jewelry from her Uncommon James line and I wanted something similar so when I saw those at Forever 21 I just had to pick them up they're like four bucks I think actually how much are they yeah they're $4.90 super cute super trendy love gold jewelry it's my favorite to wear if you guys haven't noticed I'm always wearing gold so yeah, that is everything in my collective haul video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. A thumbs up if you guys want to see more collective hauls like this because I'm constantly shopping and I kind of gather all the things that I bought in a recent little time period and share them with you guys. If you have any specific hauls that you guys want to see on my channel, leave them down below. All of your requests are highly, highly recommended. And I know you guys want to see another Shein haul. I asked you guys on Instagram and a lot of you guys want to see another Shein haul. So if there something specifically from Shein that you want to see on my channel or me try on send it to me in my Instagram DM like take a picture of it and DM it to me or leave it in the comments below what type of things you guys want to see on my channel that is pretty much it thank you guys so much for watching I hope you have a wonderful day morning evening whenever you're watching this video and if you're watching to the end don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see all of your beautiful faces in my next video bye guys Wherever I go, you're the one